Hi, I'm Tony Cece. And I'm Thomas Cece. I'm the owner of the Tony Robertson Hair Spa in Cowinnan. The salon's been here for just over 12 years. The hairdressing industry is really creative, really fun, really fast moving, and it's really sociable. Myself and Thomas's roles in the salon are to make sure the day-to-day -day running of the salon goes as smooth as possible, making sure that the staff are all well, and also we do a lot of behind the scenes work, including social media, accounts, and paperwork involving the salon. So how I got into hairdressing was completely by chance. I needed a summer job just after school and uh, a salon took me on and I completely fell in love with hairdressing. So I'm originally from Manchester, so this just shows you how versatile that the skills can be. How I first got into hairdressing was I was offered a Saturday job by a local salon at the age of 15. Um, I wasn't like Thomas, I didn't fall in love with hairdressing quite as soon as. So I went on to study travel and tourism at a local college. Then I was offered more hours within the salon. And then that's when my passion for hairdressing developed. The advice that we would give to people looking to get into the hairdressing industry is be confident, be individual, don't be scared to break any boundaries. Yeah, it's all about showing your creative side. Um, a, a huge part of the hairdressing industry is you've got to enjoy the job, you've got to love the job. If not, it's not going to be an industry where you're going to feel comfortable in. So the highlights of my career would be going along to do huge photo shoots for big designers such as Comme des Garçons, uh, I have also done celebrity hair for Sophie Anderton, Gemma Atkinson, Chantelle Hubton, and I've worked with the Terry Girls uh, on several days uh, shoots. Uh, these are huge highlights in my career, but probably the biggest highlight in my career was actually opening Tony Robertson Hair Spa. This was helped with the funds from my papa who's no longer with us, um, and that was a huge, huge part for me in my hairdressing career. So the highlight of my hairdressing career is probably now. Myself and Tony are in the middle of setting up a brand new hair academy. So this will be developing young people's skills and training them up to become a hairdresser. What we want to do in House of Cissé Hairdressing Academy is develop young care experience people. This is something that we're really passionate about. Myself and Tony have adopted two children and we know that the care system can be really tough. So when we're recruiting team members for the hair spa, what we really look at is personality. This is so important. You need to come across an interview that you're smiley, that you're enthusiastic, that you want to be here. Why should we pick you? Yeah, individuality is a huge part of the interview process for us at the hair spa. The skills and qualities that we look for in someone joining the hair spa team would be great timekeeping and again, being able to fit in as part of the team. Definitely. You need to have that get up and go. You need to let your personality shine when you're coming in for an interview. It's really, really important. And using your own initiative, that's a huge part for us in the interview process. My top tip coming into the hairdressing industry would be never to criticise another person's work within the industry. We're all there to help each other and be part of the same industry. The only competition you'll have within the industry will be yourself. So my top tip if you want to be in the hairdressing industry is be diverse. Don't be scared to be different, be individual, that's what we're looking for.